All right, guys, welcome back to a very special day. It's opening day of food and wine. We have not done an opening day in forever. Go ahead and hit like, hit and subscribe, turn on notifications, and let's go have fun. All right, here's a site we haven't seen in forever. I kid, I kid. Well, it has been forever for you guys. I haven't done a vlog in like two or three weeks, so welcome back, guys. Let's go. First things first, they don't have the passports out like they usually do. We're gonna see if maybe they have them at the booths or something, but so far no passports. How am I supposed to know what I wanna try? And oh, because I looked at the menus, that's right. But I still need my passport. I need to get my stamps for stuff. Come on, people, give me my passport. Okay, guys, typically they don't do merch, but here's this year's pins. We've got this one, uh, it is $17.99. We've got this one, I think it's about $17.99 as well. This one's $19.99, it's got Mirabelle. And then down here we've got the whole Madrigal family. And this is $17.99. So most of them are $17.99. I'm not gonna lie guys, I mean these are cute, but the merch this year seems kind of bland. Yeah, $19.99. And this one's $19.99 too, this one. And here's this year's lounge fly. I actually kind of like this one. It's, it's probably the nicest of the merch. And this year's Corsicle um, <laughs> Tumblr. Let's see, how much was this? $50. $50. Remember, if you got an annual pass holder discount, you know, then you apply that, but 50 bucks. Corsicle is just getting more expensive. Over to the brewing to try the pickle milkshake, and it's not bad. Uh, we also got some peanut butter jelly wings. They're also very good every year. They're one of my favorites, so get them. And then uh, just checking out the entire brew wing experience. It is Muppet themed this year. That's really, really awesome. I kind of wish they had some Muppets actually in there having some fun with us, but I'll take the screen. I'll take whatever Muppets I can get. I mean, I'm a huge fan of the Muppets. I say bring them over to this park over in the American Pavilion and like just redo that whole show with Muppets. I think that would be awesome wouldn't it anyways um <laughs> i hope you guys like the brew wing come check it out uh come try all the wings and drinks and there's going to be a little more from here in a few moments so stay tuned all right Cass. so guys cassidy got hey yes i see characters we got this cassidy's doing this today and this is going to be a lot of fun we've already found one in canada there's your only hint as to one of the stickers. All right, we're gonna move forward and move on and keep doing this. Right on time, guys. We got our clouds of doom. I wouldn't say right on time, actually. It's not even one o'clock yet, but clouds of doom, hello. Doom, doom, doom. I haven't even been drinking yet. Cheers for the fried pickles, guys. Mmm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna fry a pickle over. These are done right, Disney. Good job. Mm. Very good job. What's up, guys? So you probably just saw me try a few things from opening day for food and wine, but now we're back. It's a couple weeks later. Uh, we took off last time, and I'm gonna finish out what I intended to do last time, and we're just putting it all together. So if you didn't already, make sure you like, subscribe, and share like the vlog it's always a lot of fun let's go have some good old food all right guys we got a favorite of today we got the canadian cheddar and bacon soup with the little pretzel roll from canada outpost over here i am excited because i love this it's so hot out here today but and this might have not have been the best choice but we're going to do it anyways let's dig in honestly the best way to start out just dip the bread right right in guys it's Mm. That's very good. Actually, the temperature is really good right now too. It's it's not too hot of a soup right now, and the bread is nice and nice and soft, not too hard or anything. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Onward. And from Brazil, obviously, gotta be my favorite, the Brazilian cheese bread. Let's dig in. Bon appetit. Mmm. Nice and cheesy very good very warm maybe not the best on a hot day but it is good make sure you get it sometime while the food and wine festival is going on all right guys back to the brew wing we're going to try the frozen fusion we're also going to try 
our cider flight. First up, though, is going to be the frozen fusion, which is very, very good. Very yummy. Got some twinings flavors in there. Then we have our Blake's Hard Cider Code Tropicolata Hard Cider. Not bad. Pretty good. Then we have the Bold Rock Beach Peach Berry Hard Cider. Uh, that one wasn't my favorite, but it was okay. And then the Three Daughters Brewing Raspberry Lemonade Hard Cider. Probably my second favorite. Hi right, guys, let's go do it for us here from Epcot. The last couple days we've been here. And uh, Cassidy, did you enjoy all your stuff that you tried? Definitely. Cool. All the good stuff. Cool. All right. So we're going to head on out, guys. Go ahead and hit like, subscribe, share, turn on notifications. There'll be more food and wine. It's a long festival. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy the <laughs> fact that I had to like kind of stitch things together from last time we were here to now. Um, I just finally have enough footage. So on to the next video, guys. I think it might, <coughs> it might be from Universal actually. Oh yeah, you guys don't know that. I have my pass now for Universal again. Anyways, as Walt would always say, keep moving forward and I'll see you guys in the next video. Monorail telling us have a great day. Bye guys.